Hi there, my name is the Drama Go, and thank you so much for clicking on this video. I'm here to talk about my Congressional Debate Extended Unit, which also might be called Student Congress. When you purchase this product, you will get a zip folder that you can download. And inside that zip folder, you'll start with Congressional Debate Extended Unit, and this is going to be your scope and sequence. As you can see, the first two weeks of this unit go over constitutional basics. The students learn about the Bill of Rights, as well as the legislative process with discussion, key Supreme Court cases, and more. There's activities and lots of fun ways to learn in there. And whenever you get to a material that's listed that you, uh, you don't recognize the name of, that's going to be included in that um, folder by name. So let's see, that was small group self-evaluation form. We will find it right in there. The small group self-evaluation form right there. <laughs> the second week we get into learning Robert's Rules of Order, which is the par parliamentary procedure that is used in student congress or congressional debate. It's very important that students know and understand this in order to participate properly and earn the maximum amount of points. So there's a whole activity in that. On week three, we're doing research over the docket, which is the list of legislation that's going to be used in congressional debate. Um, if you're doing this for a competition, those will be posted before the debate, so students will have time to research. Or you can just make up your own docket to use in class. Either way it works. There's worksheets and activities, as well as more handouts, so that's just supplemented materials for students. And as you can see, those are all in that folder. We also talk about um, logical fallacies a little bit. And the next week they participate in congressional debate, so we start slow and we work up to competition speed to just kind of get used to the whole thing. So students start um, prepping and start engaging in congressional debate then with some more activities. Next they practice with additional preparatory activities, um, focusing on extemporaneous speaking and communication skills. They engage in congressional debate using Robert's Rules of Order that they've learned in that next week. And then we end by taking time to reflect on what we've learned through congressional debate. As you can see, each one of these uh, many units within this extended unit, which is nine weeks long, each unit starts with the learning objective and has a writing response, a, which all, could also be called a bellwork question or a do now, whatever you call it at your school. It has one of those for every single day of this nine week unit. And then we go into the lesson sequence that so tells you exactly what to do and in the order you should do it. Each week also has materials you're going to need for the unit, as well as groupings and ideas for modifications and accommodations. And of course, at the end, a rubric for assessment. It has that for every single week in this extended unit. Thank you so much for listening.